li I'm, not, I'm not even going to joke this, is literally dynamite so that we don't actually get hurt with water type moves nearly as badly. Hey, yeah, for the honor of my village, I fight in the Tandor Championship. The gods will guide me to victory. As long as it's Lord Cube, I have no problem. Good work getting through Victory Row, but the biggest challenge lies ahead of you. I kind of do the championship similar to how I did the, uh, like, the Pokemon Insurgents, but unfortunately, like, I don't think I have the luxury of that anymore. That sparkle in your eye, you're planning to become champion, aren't you? Oh, ho, ho, good luck to you. Cool. I've never seen so many strong trainers in one place before. Okay. What is this? Oh, this is like previous champions? Apparently I can't even... Okay, well I guess I can't see the previous champions. Funny. Okay, here's the sands. Wow, we're gonna be battling in a place like this? Wow! Actually, I have a question. If I were to click A around here... No, you don't get to see the battlefield. Oh, what's this? This shuttle leads to the train station in Legend Town. Would you like to ride the shuttle? No. I guess this is so that like the people can actually get up here, so that they can like like cheer on who they want to cheer on. Who do you think is going to win the champion this year? Obviously, us. My bets are on Maria, of course. She won last year, after all. That's kind of mean, man. I've been. I've been grinding for about 10 hours to get 7 Pokemon to like level 70. You're gonna come and tell me that it was worthless? I'm saving again, I don't know why. Uh, what do you guys have to say? Oh, are you a trainer? Would you allow us to interview you for a new story? Sure, great. This is Gabby reporting live from the Tandor Championship. The air in here is crackling with energy. I can almost taste these trainers' determination. Ew. However, only one of them will come out on top. Who will it be? Here with me is one of the trainers who will be taking on the challenge. How do you know? First of all, how do you know I'm a trainer? Second of all, how the heck do you know I'm going to be taking on the challenge? I could be here as a trainer just like, you know, just like coming up with strategies like, okay, like, you know, next year, I'm, I know that this guy's going to use a Heracross so I can, so I can use an Ice type to get rid of it or something like, you know what I mean? Like... How do you know, like, I'm gonna actually go through the challenge? Tell me, what is your name? I am Xylostar. Xylostar, wait a minute. Xylostar, as in the same Xylostar that put a stop to the power plane attacks? No. <laughs> I've just happened to be named like that guy, like that person. Wow, you're a national hero. Of course, a powerful trainer like you, it's only natural that you'd end up here. Well, with someone like you in the running, there's no doubt about it, we're in for a thrilling championship and cut. That was great. And I'm sure our viewers from all over Tandor will be rooting for you. Of course, we'll be filming the battles too. We'll keep our eye on you for sure. Can I talk to you? Thank you. Thanks for the interview. We'll be reporting live coverage of all the battles too. Good luck up there. I'm actually kind of surprised that I'm talking to the cameraman, but yet the reporter is the one that's speaking to me. Alright, well, because I can't actually initiate the same dialogue, I'm going to save it again. Just for simplicity. Okay. Anyway, let's, I guess, let's, oh. Okay, then. I guess I'm waiting. All right. Oh, I'm supposed to click A. Oh, sorry. Wait, Zalstar. Zalstar, you didn't think I was going to miss your league challenge, did you? I kind of thought you would. Is this is Bamba, or is this my dad? I'm confused. I came here as fast as I could when I heard you were making your way through Victory Road. There's no way I'd miss this. After all, I was there when it all began. Ah, it's Bamba, okay. Uh, okay, the arrow. Okay, they're actually pointing at the person. Okay, sometimes they don't. They don't point to the exact person that's speaking, and I get thrown off. So, so I know that I haven't always been there for you. I realize that now, but I'm determined to make up for it. I promise I won't miss a minute of your rise to glory. After all, you are my child. What else should a father do? Huh? Hey, have you seen Theo? I thought he'd be with you somehow. What? Theo and Cameron left the head Ranger headquarters some time ago. I too thought they'd be here. But I guess not. After all, they're both still recovering from their battles against Curry. Hey, wait up! 
Oh, uh, I thought it was gonna be like the the like the berry rival where they just ride into you and like thud. <laughs> uh, you thought you were gonna challenge the league without me? Yeah. <laughs> as if I'd as if I'd make it that easy on you, Zalstar. We're rivals, so that means wherever you go, I'll be there too. I'll be watching as well, of course. I ex I fully expect to see the both of you make it to the final round. Haha, <laughs> you can bet on me, Dad. Well, Zelstar, I'm, I gotta make uh, some final preparations. My Pokemon will be in tip-top shape. See you in the arena. After all this time and everything he's been through, he's still filled with energy. That kid's fighting spirit can't be stopped. If it comes down to you and Theo in the finals, Zelstar, I wonder which of you will come out on top. Only time will tell. Anyway, we're going to take our seats. Good luck out there. I wonder if you can actually find them in the stands. Okay, do you guys have any cool items, maybe? Okay, you're the Pokeball person. That's fine. Any cool held items, maybe? No? Well, the guy said we can't use items. I mean, I kind of already have that rule. So, that doesn't actually technically hurt me. Can I find my... Can I find those people in the stands? I'm not seeing anyone. Guess not. Okay. Alright, well, that entire encounter happened. Alright. Doesn't really matter, I already have a save for it. Anyway. Beyond this point is the Tandor Championship Arena. Once you begin, you must continue until you, either you win or defeat it. Also, no items may be used in battle other than what your Pokemon already hold. Are you sure you wish to enter the arena? Uh, give me one second. Oh, oh, okay. Take your time. Prepare yourself. Alright. I just want to double check something now. Okay. Everybody has the items, right? That I... I want... I kind of want to give Vampiro the benefit of the doubt and give it Shell Bell just so that it has like three things of recovery or two things of recovery. But I know that's overkill. Choice Scarf, I think that's the right option because that means that we have over 240 speed, I think. I think that's how you kind of look at it. So, yeah, we should be pretty well good. And that means... Evie's the fastest Pokemon that we have. And second would be Dynamite, and third would probably be Vampiro. Okay, let's see here. King's Rock is fine. Achillesite, Leftovers, Choice Specs, Choice Scarf, Expert Belt. Yep, that's fine. Alright, we should be good to go. Alright. Beyond this point, is the arena, blah, blah, blah. Yes, alright. Yes, I wish to, I wish to go in. Up next, round one, Zalastar vs. Angelica. Trainers, prepare your teams for battle and report to the league attendant when you are ready. Okay. Okay. If I... Wait. Is this like Sword and Shield? Where you get to see like all the people that are participating? This doesn't make any sense though. Why is there only four people in this room then? Or is it like you get to see from like your your corner like your bracket kind of thing that would be pretty interesting all right uh let's see how far evie can go <laughs> i'm actually kind of curious how far will evie go with just using hyper voice against everything that would be cool all right all right there buddy i've done all the preparations i have i've I've moved my Eevee in front. Or I've moved Eevee in front. Are you ready for the next round? What are you talking about? This is the first round. Sure. I guess that's future proofing, maybe? So, the, like, in the next one, he doesn't have to change his mind. Uh, very well. Please proceed into the arena. All right. Wow. It's a very packed crowd. Did they put my character's model up there? Oh, look. There they are. There's the Cameron, Bambo, and my dad. Look at that. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. People of Tandor, welcome to the first round of the Pokemon League Tournament. We have some of Tandor's best and brightest here to tassel you with their spectacular battling skills. I can feel the anticipation in the air. These trainers have spent their entire lives preparing for this moment. But only one will be crowned champion today. Who will it be? Are you telling me that we're... That she's the champion? That doesn't make any sense. This isn't that Maria? The trainer's skill in battle will determine that answer. Oh, I'm so excited. 
Wow, you look like a really strong trainer. Um, I'm Angelica, I and I train fairy types. We're cute, but don't let it fool you. We're really strong too. After all, fairies can stand up to the power of dragons. Some dragons, not all of them. So we aren't afraid of any tough looking trainers either. If you aren't equated with the power of fairies, then you'll know soon enough. Hey, I have a fairy. The rules of battle will be as follows. No items may be used other than what the Pokemon are already holding. The battle will continue until either side has no Pokemon left that can fight. If both trainers are ready, then battle start. All right. All right, Angelica, let's see what you got. Nymphlora. All right, Evie. Hyper voice. Time to voice your complaints over this game being... I don't know. <laughs> Perfect. There you go. Nice. Again, Evie. Time to voice your complaints. Easy. Alright. Okay, uh, hopefully, if this is gonna finally game at me, hopefully it doesn't get affected by, like, if it's super effective or not. Like, it just double damage because it's super effective or whatever. Uh, wait, we're quad plus stab. And if Atoma dies is, like, aerial aid or whatever, that boosts the move damage. This should kill, right? I would have to worry about us not outspeeding. That's the only thing I'm not worried about. Okay, good. Okay, this might be a problem. Sylveon is pretty bulky in special de in like in special attack in general. So hyper voice, maybe I could do it. I think Sylveon might survive. No? Okay, good. I'm gonna do hyper voice again. Go as far as we can with just Evie, I guess. Okay, aren't aren't you two like fairy only? Let's see here. Angelica, yeah, okay. Uh let's see here. Uh let's see here. Yeah, they're both mono fairy. What? I guess two point five is enough. Okay. Hyper voice. And down you go. I wonder what items you had, because they didn't work. Goodness, you really are quite strong, I guess. We tried our hardest in this battle, but, and that's what counts. What a match! Evie took out all of them in one shot each time. A thrilling display from traders and Pokemon alike. Up next, round two. Salasal vs. Sir Goldcorn. Friends, prepare your teams for battle and report to the League Attendant when you are ready. Okay. Uh. Do we get our power points healed? Because that's the only thing I really care about. Oh, good! They did get healed! <laughs> they did get healed! Nice! That's actually gonna be helpful. Very helpful, actually. I'm not even gonna lie. That is very helpful. Okay. Uh. Hopefully. This guy has, like, a better Pokemon. I can actually be able to do it. Uh, give me one, one second. I want to switch. Actually, I don't know if this guy even has a specialty, so let's just jump right in. Are you ready for the next round? Uh, yeah. Very well, please proceed into the arena. Uh, his name is off the board. Did you see that? It was, like, off the board, too. Folks, we're back for, with round two. Both of these traders took home a win in the previous round. Their, their strength is no joke. I can tell that they are both itching for another fight. Well, let's not delay. On with the match. I do say, have we perchance met before? I believe so. I am certain we have. You do leave quite an impression indeed. However, allow me to reintroduce myself. I am Sir Goldcorn. I represent a refined style of battle. A tradition which is sadly going away, it seems. But I shall prove that refinement still has a place in the arena. Please allow us to have a clean, civil match. 
Civil. Evie's gonna be a savage in this battle. He just says the same thing, so I'm just gonna skip the dialogue for that. All right. Oh, Tansker, uh, normal dark. So, which means, Evie, type to voice your opinion yet again. Yeah, Evie doesn't like your your garbage. I don't know. Splendor Fowl. Hi, the voice again. Perfect. Alright, that's two. Whimsicott? Uh this has a prior this has priority with what is it, Prankster, I think? How would this work though? Oh never mind, it doesn't have Prankster. Okay. Don't have to worry about it. Whew. Cause it could have Prankster and I think Whimsicott gets access to Tailwind? Or it could have like stun spored me or something like that. Uh I should be able to take out with one hyper voice. There we go. Hero Loon. You're not surviving, buddy. It's like, no, my hero loon. <laughs> there you go. Evie's a monster. Just stop. Stop, Evie. He's already dead. <laughs> Alright, Barriot, you're down. No way you can survive that. Perfect. I say. You say what? Goodness, that was quite a thorough route. I'm hoping that's how you pronounce it that way. Uh, I may require some tea and biscuits after this match. If you like, you would be welcome to join me. What a match! A thrilling display from trainers and Pokemon alike. Oh, he just says the same thing? Okay. Up next, round three. Salazar versus Sheldon. Ooh, this is where we start getting towards the gym leaders, I guess. Okay.